guys, today I'm gonna show you how to make fried cauliflower chicken. Like, you know, actual fried chicken. But of course, no animals were harmed in the making of this dish. It's super easy to make. It's actually super fun to make also. And of course, it's so tasty. Here's a little sneak preview of what's to come. And I also just made a little side salad for the side because this is fried cauliflower. I thought it'd be nice to balance it up a little with something a bit more healthy. So it's just roasted beets and sweet potato salad. And I'll put the recipe for both of these in the link below. So let's get started. <laughs> We're going to make a wet dredge and a dry coating. The first thing we'll do is mix ground flaxseed with water and allow it to sit to create a flax egg. While we're waiting for that to thicken up, we can make our dry mixture. Combine flour and all the dry spices in a bowl and stir well to combine. Once our flax mixture has thickened, we can add the hot sauce and the Dijon mustard. Again, we'll stir this real good. Now, let's chop our cauliflower. Keeping in mind that we're trying to make shapes that are somewhat similar to fried chicken, I like to chop the cauliflower into medium-sized chunks after removing the stem and the leaves. Now let's dip and fry our cauliflower pieces. Make sure to use one hand for the dredge and the other for the dry mixture. It's important to keep them separate so you don't get the dry mix too wet. Make sure to flip the pieces so that they fry evenly. Place them on a paper towel to soak up the excess oil. For the first batch, I only battered each piece once before dipping them into the frying oil. However, double battering is a much better way to get that crispy coating. And this is what I did with the later batches. For our side salad, combine roasted sweet potatoes and beets, cooked lentils, fresh cilantro and parsley, black pepper, and red onion. This will be a great complement to the fried cauliflower, and they look lovely together on the plate. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and this amazing cauliflower chicken. So give it a try, let me know what you think. I really like this recipe because it's double battered and also because there's so much of that yummy hot sauce in the sauce, so it's very full of flavor. Now I just wanna show you, I did a couple single batter just so you would see the difference. The batter doesn't stay on there as well and they don't get as nice and crispy. So I highly encourage you to make sure you do the double batter so that you have this beautiful, nice fried cauliflower. Mmm, so juicy. Even before I was vegan, I never really liked fried chicken because the skin just grossed me out. But this is such a better alternative. Of course, 
it's healthier <laughs> and it's you no know, chickens were harmed so it's more ethical and it's super delicious I hope you guys I really hope you guys give this one a try for sure and it's actually crunchy on the outside and so juicy and moist on the inside it's so perfect people in your family who are not vegan who still love chicken this is a really great recipe to ease them into the vegan lifestyle or even just to get people you love or yourself to eat more vegetables like healthy cauliflower. So give it a try, let me know what you think. Make sure to tag me if you take any photos and post them on social media. And if you're not already subscribed to my channel, Sweet Potato Soul, please subscribe now and I will see you again soon. Bye.